The mental health of first responders, an issue that was front and center in Gulf Shores tonight. Nationwide, first responders' suicides are on the rise. But now efforts are underway to try to tackle that problem. News 5's Brianna Hollis joins us live to tell us about the mental health first aid program. Bree? So, Pete, listen to this. I couldn't even believe it when I saw these statistics, but right now more firefighters are dying from suicide than they are in the line of duty. And those stats right there are making such a bold statement. The fire departments across the state are bringing in professionals to address the issue. You know, we run upwards to 3,000 calls a year. For firefighters, no matter what city you serve, the scene's intense. Once you open the door, you're faced with flames, smoke, people in pain. And, and a majority of those calls are, are people in distress. Uh, we, we cope with, you know, those people's stressors uh, all the time. Today, mental health experts took a group of Gulf Shores firefighters away from the chaos and into the classroom. So in a controlled space, away from all the trauma, they got the chance to learn about warning signs when it comes to their own mental health. They see so much trauma, they're under so much stress, that sometimes their fellow uh, co-workers and peers can develop a mental illness. It's a problem that's really always been there, but now more people are talking about it. We kind of push mental health away. The numbers are changing that. In 2017, 103 firefighters died from suicide. By comparison, 93 lost their lives in the line of duty. A hard topic to, to get around to everyone. So if you remove the stigma and start talking about it, more people can go and get the professional help that they need. Something crucial so our firefighters can go out and help who they need to and come back knowing they can get help of their own. And whether you're a first responder or not, the group that held the session today has a 24-hour crisis hotline. That number is at the bottom of your screen there. It is 877-435-7425. And, of course, we'll also have that on our website, WKRG.com. Reporting live in Gulf Shores, Brianna Hollis, WKRG News 5.